With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, in this given question we need to work on which of the following will give a pair of enantiomers. So what is this enantiomer? They are the optical isomers which is of the form D form and L form. So obviously they are representing the optical isomers. So let's work upon the following. So first of all there is correction this. There is going to be this coordination sphere and this is also going to be the coordination sphere. So basically these are the coordination isomers not the enantiomers. So this is obviously not going to be our answer because same type of ligands are being present. So how the optical isomer will be there because their mirror images are going to be superimposable in nature. So no optical isomerism will be shown over here. Now consider this one. So how we will do? First of all, I'm ionizing this compound CO and H3 whole 4 Cl2. This is the one part coordination part and this is going to be ionic part. So we are going to represent this one. So if I tell you that this is the octahedral geometry of given complex and if we take over here this side, whether you take the cis form or trans form, all are going to be monodented ligand. So if you draw the mirror image also, then they are going to be superimposable. So that's why no use of taking this as the optical. So the reason is going to be superimposable image. So if I draw the mirror image also, so this is the mirror image of this transform. So it's not going to show optical activity. Why? Because these images are going to be superimposable in nature. So it's also not going to show an enantiomeric pair. Let's go with option C. This is the coordination entity given. Similar problem arises here also. What's the reason there? The reason is that here the presence of same type of ligands is there which is monodented ligand and they are contributing six ligands. So similar geometry will be drawn and they are going to be superimposable in nature. So it's also not going to show. Lastly, we are left with COEN whole twice Cl2. So first of all, if I ionize this compound COEN whole twice where EN is representing bidented ligand that is our ethylene diamine. So this is going to be Cl2 and upon ionizing it's going to give this type of set. So we need to check for optical isomer in this compound. So let me draw its geometry. So it's also going to have two geometry. One is going to be cis form, another is going to be transform. Transform will be drawn just like this one. If I draw the transform, then we will consider the cis. So C and Cl and Cl are going to be exactly opposite. And En will be represented over here because it is bidentate ligand. So this transform, if I also draw the mirror image, then it's going to be superimposable in nature. So that's why transform is not going to show optical activity, but we are going to draw the cis form. So let's also check for the cis form. This one was transform. Now we are taking the cis. So cis orientation means two groups are going to be exactly adjacent. So if I draw the rest set of structure, so this will be occupied by En where En is representing our NH2, CH2, CH2, NH2 that is ethylene diamine. Over here this is being occupied by En. Now if I draw the mirror image of this compound, so it's going to be cobalt and occupying mirror image. How? This Cl will be adjacent. Here this right thing will be transferred to the left side and this left side will be transferred to right side. That's how we are going to construct the mirror image. So now if you try to superimpose these two images which are having same formula they are going to be non superimposable image and that's why they are called as the optical isomers or we can call them enantiomers one is going to be of d form another one is going to be of l form so what is going to be our answer answer is going to be option d which is containing a possibility of pair of enantiomers thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.